Good morning from beautiful downtown Hancock, Michigan. I'm in the Upper Peninsula of Michigan and I'm entered as a co-driver in our Open Light Class 2002 Subaru Impreza. Friday and Saturday we will hit speeds of 90 plus miles per hour on relatively primitive Michigan dirt roads and logging trails while competing on this year's edition of the Lake Superior Performance Rally. LSPR, as it's called, is the granddaddy of all rallies here in the U.S. It's known as the oldest, meanest, toughest rally on the national circuit and usually lives up to that billing. In its former life, it was called P-O-R, stands for Press On Regardless. I ran my first one of those back in 1972, but P.O.R. began way back in the 1950s. So these folks in Michigan have been doing this a long time. I've been associated with this sport for 46 years. Not sure what the attraction was or is, but there's a comfort zone here that justifies why everybody should have a hobby. The winners will most likely be driving a factory prepared and serviced Subaru I'd estimate to be worth $300,000, $350,000. The backmarker hobbyists will have cars valued in the single digit thousands of dollars. Yet we will all be challenged, take risks, survive most of them, and those we don't, well, that's racing. And most of all, we'll have fun. The event this year has attracted over 75 entrants. That's huge in our sport. And they come from all across the country, and some from outside the country. And we all speak the same language. Blah, 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 accelerate. What really keeps me invested in this sport is the incredible teamwork that has to work for the car, the crew, the driver, and the co-driver to all click for a successful event. We can bring a car into service with any number of things going wrong, from mechanical to body parts hanging off but they've got maybe a half hour to get us back out on the road in competitive fashion. They do it every time. Then there's the banner that goes on between the co-driver and his driver. The co-driver calls notes as to what the road ahead has in store, while the driver puts that into his calculations to navigate that road as fast as he possibly can. We will race in daylight and dark. We will race in good weather and bad, especially up here where it can be 60 degrees during the day and sleet blizzard by 7 o'clock at night. They call it real cars on real roads real fast. Anyway, I'm taping this before we start, so there may be more by the time you get this. If there's one of these near you, I urge you to go see it. Oh, and it's free. If you're disappointed in any way, I'll give you your money back. I'm Kim. And this is my moment of clarity.